Hi everyone, so today we're going to be building a bunny, just like the one you see in the video. So what you'll need is just a base color, you can choose any color you want, I'm going to choose a light yellow. And then just take a piece of it and form a ball. This is the biggest ball and it's going to be used later on for the body of the bunny just like this one and we can put this one away and then we'll do same thing grab a piece of play-doh and we're gonna roll it into a ball this one used to be a little bit smaller than the previous one this is going to be a head of the bunny and then we'll make two legs so you just need two small pieces of play-doh and you're gonna form each one of them into these kind of like sticks so one here and then we'll do same thing and a second one and then go ahead and do same thing just a third stick but we're gonna separate it into two later on we'll use these for arms of the bunny then just grab another tiny piece and form it into a teardrop. This will be Bunny's ears. It doesn't have to be perfect because we'll decorate them afterwards. And then we'll make another, the second ear for the bunny, also shaped into a teardrop. So those are ready to go. And uh, if you can see, we're still working with the same base color. We're gonna do two tiny balls, just like that. And also put that away. And then now we can assemble everything. So grab the biggest ball and make an indentation in it. Just press with your finger. And then grab the smaller ball and place that right over just like that just make sure it sticks and then we're gonna make an indents in the head of the bunny for the ears so i just use a regular pencil and grab an ear and place that into that indentation and then second one same thing just press that in so that it sticks so that's ready to go we're gonna grab the tiny balls and we're gonna place it in the face area and just squeeze that in push it in so one side and then same thing for the other one and then just grab a different color I'm gonna choose a pink one this is going to be for the nose of the bunny and I'm also going to decorate ears and the tail. So we're going to grab a tiny piece and shape it into a tiny triangle. So that's what it should look like. Just very tiny. It doesn't have to be perfect either. And then we're going to place it right over here just like that. And then I have a toothpick and I'll just make three tiny holes on one side and on the other one. And then we'll make also holes for the eyes of the bunny. We'll also need different color for the eyes. I just grabbed this beige. You can do white. So we'll do one and then also just grab another piece, roll it into a tiny ball and then just push it into that hole. So that's the base of the eyes and now we'll need to choose the color. I'm going to do a blue. So just grab another piece, you don't need a lot, just a little bit. And then we're gonna roll it into a tiny ball 
and that's gonna go on top of the base of the eye so just push that in and then we'll do same thing to the other side grab a tiny piece roll it into a bowl and then place it on top of the other eye so the eyes are almost done we just need a final piece we're gonna add a pupil to it so just a tiny block dot so you really just need a small the tiniest piece you can do i'm gonna use also a toothpick with this one i'm gonna grab just a little bit roll it into just a small ball again put it back on the toothpick and then with that i'm gonna place it in the middle of the eye just like that push that in and then same thing again with the other eye we're gonna grab a tiny small piece with the toothpick roll it a little bit into a ball place it back onto the toothpick and put it on the eye so now we're gonna decorate the ears of the bunny i grabbed the same color that i used for the nose formed this play-doh into a teardrop and placed it on top of the ear just like that and then we'll form another one another teardrop and then also place that onto bunny's other ear it just looks much cuter like that so other one's ready and we're just gonna go ahead and put that over on the ear and then once that's on you can just pull on the ears make them a little bit longer also just curve them in a little bit just so they look better and now we'll do the legs so we're gonna grab one of the bigger sticks and then we're gonna attach it to the body on the bottom and then you're just gonna press that in and curve it in like a Z It's helpful if you just put it on the table and that way you can uh, curve the play-doh into any shape you want just like that and we'll do the same thing on the other side press it in on the side and then curve it so to curve it into a Z shape so right here So that's done and then we'll do the arms of the bunny so we'll grab the smaller sticks and attach it slightly above the legs and then the second one as well so we'll also add a tail for the bunny and again i'm going to use just the pink play-doh that i used for the nose and the ears we'll go ahead and just attach it on the back just like that And then we'll add a carrot for the bunny so i'm grabbing orange and green color and then we'll form the orange play-doh into like a cone that's going to be the carrot and then on the thicker side just push it in and add the green play-doh so that it looks like greenery on the carrot and place that into bunny's hands just like that so that is all to the bunny i hope yours turned out awesome as well